going over the trading system results for today, we're going to do the 50K, 200K, and then all strategy access. Some of these are duplicate, Cobra Crude, plus 510, conservative. On the 50K and gap continuation 2020, minus 325, up a little bit today. Actually, that should be 485. There is no slippage in commission on that. So plus 45 and minus 325, up just about 160 on the day. On the 50K portfolio, let's go over the 200K portfolio next. NASDAQ is reaching for um, 15,000 once again. You see 14,948.50 right here on the 60-minute uh, chart. Trades on the 200K gap continuation, these are three lot setups, minus 975 on gap continuation, trading at three lots, so divide by three. Uh, Cobra 3 is minus 1875, so minus 625 per contract, um, plus 825 on 60-minute breakout. Divide that one by three as well. 60-minute breakout plus 44.25, hitting its profit target right at the end of the day. The market continues to surge. It continues to make larger V patterns, smaller V patterns. You see the intraday V patterns in the market. And we have this month of July, which is tends to be really strong. The year 2021, still a lot of euphoria around the lows during the pandemic and a lot of momentum. A lot of liquidity driving this market higher, uh, whether it should or should not. It's hard to say, but we just go with it mostly, and strategies were profitable on the day. Metals, one short trade on Esther Counter Trend Silver, three lot. Um, and these are just three lots. If you're trading one lot, you just divide by, you divide by three. So plus 475 on that per lot. Energies, Cobra Crew, they're 485 per contract on the on the um, conservative and aggressive Cobra crude, crude oil back up, reaching for $72. It was down at 65 a few days ago. Now right back up to 72 I'm bullish crude long term. And in crude oil, you're going to see lots of volatility fluctuations. Soybeans, no trades on the day. All strategy access is next. Minus 625 on the Cobra 3 ESs. Profit target, non-profit target. The market, the indices are going against the broader market. The broader market was weak, and the indices um, played contrarian and went up today. So plus 275 on 60-minute breakout, adaptive moving average plus 275. Not a lot of trades today, really. Uh, plus 187.50 on VSD. And go over the NQ strategies. We have gap continuation 2020 minus 325 on the day. Tick count trend, which has been on a roll, is minus 50 on the day. In Q2, plus 13.60 on 60-minute breakout, plus 11.30 on 60-minute breakout A, minus 3.25 on PR breakout, tick wave, minus 8.25, plus 1,070. This is position is still open on VSD long only. Uh, VSD long short is plus 2.40. You'll notice that the market, the stock index is used to be closed between 3.15 and 3.30. They now are not closed during that time period, which makes sense. The other futures markets like gold and crude oil are not. So they've changed that. So if you see price action between 315 and 330, that is the new norm. So Viper 2008 plus 775, gap continuation 2019, big stop loss minus 725. Exhaust and reverse, no trades. Euro minus 325. Gold, no trades on the day in gold. Slow day. In gold, silver, we had some SR Counter Trend 2 V2s, or just one SR Counter Trend 2, actually, V2s were yesterday. Uh, SR Counter Trend 2, plus 475. Copper, no trades. Crude oil, we had the Cobra Crudes trading today for 485 each. Natural gas, got in on the action. Gas and Arbob and crude oil were all very strong today. Um, this is bullish. I'm bullish on the energy still. Wouldn't be surprised to see these markets double. Going into the end of the year, just a feel for inflation that I have. It doesn't mean I'm trading that. Um, but that's just the feeling that I have about crude oil and natural gas and what I'm seeing in the price action, plus 475 on all three of these. And Arbob, really strong trend higher today in Arbob. Uh, old and optional, by the way, that, that loss right there, that was yesterday. So the red line indicates uh, each day. Old and optional, over 120 strategies every day. Soybeans, no trades. Over 120 strategies we track every day. Um, eight basic portfolios that we have. And so those are the trades on the day for July the 22nd, 2021.